Viviana Openoff shocks Natasha Jonas with a fourth round TKO. TKO. Towel thrown in. Let's talk about Five, it. Five, four, three, two, one. You can hate him for not making that fight happen. But this is an unbiased show. We talk boxing. If it is just some missed details, the Double RT Boxing Show, Mr. A is here to help you because that's what we do. We talk that boxing, spit that fire on the internet, dragging on the net, hashtag dragging on the net. You know, follow me on at Twitter at RRTB Show. Double RT, the Double RT, the Double RT Boxing Show with Mr. A. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, she shocked the the world with stopping Natasha Jonas. Viviana Openoff did. Got did, um, went against my grain. I picked her to lose this fight. But let's be honest. There was some heavy flaws in Natasha by backing up in a straight line. But the biggest difference and the biggest reason why Openoff won this fight, she fixed her biggest flaw. Her biggest flaw and exactly the flaw I talked about in the breakdown and prediction for this fight right here on the Double RT Boxing Show, she fucking was looking at what she was punching at. This fight was the first fight and I seen about, besides the Katie Taylor, the Chantel, I seen other fights of doing research of open off. This is the first fight she's not looking at the mat as she's throwing punches. First fucking fight. And she was looking at the target and her punches were not wow. They were not missing. They were on point. And it's all because she kept her fucking head up. Great job. You know, great job. She came out like a bee. N- nothing changed in her style. She always comes out like a bat out of hell, throwing punches left and right, throwing the kitchen sink at you. The only thing that changed was every other fight I've seen open off that's open off <laughs> this fight she's looking at what I guess she learned she learned from taking the ass from, from Chantel like damn she had to watch that film she said she wasn't right in the head during that fight but she's like what the hell happened to me Chantel was looking at her and whooping her ass Viviana, Viviana looked at that film and probably said like Dude, she hit me and she, she was fucking looking dead at me as she was hitting me. I'm going to do that. I'm going to look dead at Natasha and just hit the shit out of her. And she fucking right hand after right hand. And they weren't just grazing right hand. They were chin checking right hands. Like I said, it didn't help that uh, Natasha Jonas made the big flaw of just backing up in a straight line. You know, and then she tried to exchange with this uh, heavy-handed wow machine. She's like a female uh, Maidana, just throws fucking punches. And that, that's what the biggest thing was. You know, once in a while she did a few body shots because Natasha was able, when she fought smart, boom, pick the shots, pick the shots, she was doing good. She'll win the, she'll win the round, win the round. All of a sudden, she'll give away the round because she'll back up in a straight line and get hit. Like I said, the biggest reason why Viviana Openoff won this fight and congratulations to her and her corner for fixing her flaw. She kept her fucking head up. Big props, big ups to Viviana and her camp. She deserved it. Except I don't mind being wrong on this one because the girl, she's a good competitor and it's good to see someone you get tired of seeing the elites fight someone and then they always lose to the elites and now she has a name she's going to get those fights again and she's a WBA international champ now so she's in, she's in the mix maybe a couple more performances like this and Katie Taylor have no choice but do a, give, give a rematch or at least Chantel someone give a rematch to you know give, give herself a nice a nice name a nice name fight shit couple more fights and get Natasha Jonas a rematch. Whoop her ass again. See if it changes. This is the Double RT Boxing Show. I'm your host, Mr. A. Follow me at Twitter at the RRTB Show. The RRTB Show. Hit this thumbs up. Please subscribe. And what do you think? What do you think of Viviana Openoff and her team fixing her biggest fucking flaw? Watch all her fights. And this fight, she's actually fucking looking at the target. 
big, big fix and her biggest flaw. And look what the fuck happened. Thank you for tuning in. I'm your host, Mr. A.